Our game is gone. But it could be worse. It's fine. Uh, okay. Mm -hmm. Hey, we're still there. Great. Okay. Uh, we did two melee. Thanks, chat. Explosion. This on and on. We bought a sword. I'm gonna sell that. Buy a shield this time. I don't have any health pots. Oh god. Okay. I missed missed a box with the fan patch. Oh, I meant to. Yeah, we already just oh, saw this. I can't believe it. Oh, I mean, you and and then the zeppelin and. Wait, why is it not full screen? And the altar says that. Do you have any idea what all of this means? What are you going on about? You speak. I, I mean, uh, like help? I am at a loss. Please, Please slow forgive down. me. I am making a button. Really need to explain yes, things. Yes, right, right. Yeah. Mm. Uh, this is confusing. Imagine how much I feel. Who's this Joaquin? Joaquin? Let's go talk to him. Agreed. Okay, so um, it's okay for you. Oh God, for me it is not okay. Oh, why is it not okay for me? Is it because it's like windowed or something? Hold on. For me, I have giant black borders on each side. Um, okay, let me save it real quick. Let me see real quick. Is there like some way I can stretch it out in full screen? You have to enable stretching on the monitor itself. I don't even know where to start with that, my dude. All right. All of that work and we didn't change anything. Nice. Oh. Oh, so if I put on a shield, then my strength requirement for the sword goes up. Interesting. Okay. Mm. Using NVIDIA? Yeah. All right, let's get harm up. Mm -hmm. We'll get this up. Mm -hmm. Great. A camera, a broken camera, and a thermometer. All right. I do like broken cameras and thermometers. No. Grab that. Grab you. Oh, you're naked? I know. I know. It's great, isn't it? Ugh. I need to figure out what the, like, combat key is. W? No, W's... I'm gonna, I'm gonna figure this out. Alright. E? No. R? R! It's R! There we go. We did it, boys. We did it. R for combat. Of course. Why didn't I guess that? It's rombat. Exactly. Yeah, see? Oh, there's a body over there. We discovered it. <laughs> Got some gold on it. Hell yeah, dude. Give me that. I like in this game how your experience goes up with every hit. I mean, better luck next time. Wow, that was pretty brutal. So you don't get experience just for killing things. You get experience for actually like being in combat and hitting enemies. R for rabble rousing? Oh, that makes sense. Oh. Gotcha. Take 
all of your stuff. Let's get some actual armor on. Hell yeah, boy. Bam! There it is. Okay. Do a save. Oh, we got big old footprints now. Wait. Get that wolfy wolf. Let's hope we got some more gear to get. Is that a ding? Did we ding? Oh, we dinged! Yes! Yeah! Okay, so let's go ahead and get that unlocking thing like now. Yeah, boy. Okay. There will be no locked chest immune to Mr. Ko. Fantastic. Save it. Do, 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 do. Actually, let's get this first. No, don't attack it. My loots. Don't attack my loots. Sorry, bacon. It's a lesser bacon. There we go. Okay. Get some more wine. We're gonna get all of the wine. What's this? Metal plate. Oh, get that. Damn, Virgil. You straight dropped your weapon and everything. How do I give this back to him? There's no room for that item. Oh, damn, it's big. Uh, how do I give this to Virgil? What is it that you want of me? Perhaps you can trade some things. Did he put it on? He did. Okay, great. Great. Okay. Awesome. Man, it's been so long since I played this. <clears throat> Dark Hollow, thank you, bud. Oh, here we go. What is this? It seems a strange flying device, but much smaller than the blimp. I've never seen anything like it. Yes, it looks very much like the machine which attacked us. And isn't that an ogre among the wreckage? It seems very unlikely that an ogre would have the intelligence to fly such a complex device. Racist? They didn't really. They destroyed themselves in the attack. Do you see that strange amulet that he's wearing? And that symbol on its face? I don't recognize it. Do you? I can't say that I do. Ah, uh, something isn't quite right about all of this. I don't remember the, uh, scriptures talking about flying ogres and the like. We'd better get to Shrouded Hills and find Elder Joachim as soon as possible. Let's do so. And be careful. These wolves are none too friendly. This amulet has a strange symbol on its face. That of an eye in a hexagram. Sounds culty. Grab you. Dude, someone just left all this wine around. Great for us. Thank you. Will Hemina's note to Jared. My dearest Jared, I'm aboard the IFS Zephyr, speeding on my way to see you again. My breath catches when I think that in two short weeks I shall be your wife. That is correct, my dear. I am accepting your proposal. I hope thoughts of me warm your heart on your long days and nights guarding Vermilion Station from the half-orc looters you mentioned. Love always... Will help me. Oh. Well. That didn't quite work out, did it? Hmm. Oh, God. 
Did you drop your weapon again? No, you didn't. Okay, good. Do it live. Where are you going, dude? Boom! Anything on their corpses? Nope. Saltpeter and arrows. All the things. Uh, fatigue restore, health potion, small metal tube, railroad spikes, filaments, and broken flintlock pistol. And I'm getting full up here. Save it. Also, let's put that health pot on here. time thanks that's right migraine cure oh i need some of that some ore and stuff okay oh a dead guy oh a not so dead guy dynamite explosive grenade stun grenade bullets Revolver chamber, old flintlock pistol, another stun grip. Damn, son. And my inventory's full. Um. Okay, apparently we need to find a vendor. Hi. The spirit appears to be in great pain. Please, I beg of you, the pain. What happened to you, dude? I was cursed by an evil priest. My name was Charles Brego. My friend and I asked only for something to eat, some sustenance. We were poor, wandering, and he cursed us. My friend cursed with madness, attacked me, killed me, the pain. I am cursed to be held to this realm, unable to be released. Please, I need your help. What is it that you would have me do? Need to kill priest, Arbola. He lives here, points on your map. Only his death will free me. Uh, what are you going to give me for this? I know of a treasure buried for years. If you know of this treasure, why were you poor? <laughs> we had taken an oath of poverty. We were monks. I'm not certain I believe you, but I will do this for you regardless. Please hurry, release me from the pain. Um... Little crescendo there. Okay. Well, we will check that out, but first we need to get to a town or something so we can sell. <clears throat> oh, Virgil has space. That's right. That's right. What Virgil, my, my dude. Oh, yeah, you got space, my man. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, wait, is he heavy? No encumbrance? None. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It should be fine for now. We'll get all that off when we want to sell. Nice, chat. Nice. We get everything here? Yeah, looks like it. Okay, great. Go get the pistol? Oh, well, I mean, we'll be back. We'll be back. Don't you worry, chat. We'll be back. What is this? The shrine before you is crude, made of rough stone and wood. Carved into one of the stones is this. And his spirit shall be reborn on wings of fire in hills shrouded in fog. Archean 516. The altar should clear things up for us a bit. Hmm. It says, uh... And the spirit of Nazaradin shall be reborn on wings of fire in hills shrouded in fog, and fight the last battle with the evil one. 
And the evil one? Who is that? I'm sorry, but I don't know. <laughs> I guess we better find out, considering you're supposed to fight him. Probably a good idea, Virgil. Let's go. Yes, of course. It's a dude, bro! Hold there, what are you doing up here? Who are you to ask? What are you doing here? I mean no disrespect, uh, sir, but I don't trust this bastard one bit. Bloody convenient he just happened to show up here just now, don't you think? Oh, excuse my language, uh, sir. What do you recommend, Virgil? I've... Uh, dealt with buggers, uh, individuals like this before. Perhaps you'll let me talk with him for a few minutes. Of course. Go ahead. Thank you. Uh, I'll take care of this. <clears throat> you there. What exactly are you doing up here? And what gives you the right to ask so many questions? Listen. I'm just asking a simple question. What are you two doing up here? I'm from Shrouded Hills, a village not far from here, and I witnessed this terrible accident. Is it such a crime to wonder what exactly is going on? Let Virgil talk. Oh, really? Listen, I came from Shrouded Hills myself. It's at least a day's journey from here. There's no way you could have traveled here that fast. I think you're lying, sir. Sir. I, uh, I didn't come from Shrouded Hills just now. I was camping not far from here and I saw the blaze. Why are you questioning me? I've done you no harm. No. I don't think you understand. I'm asking the questions here, and I don't like your answers. I'm going to ask you one more time. Why are you here? A cold look comes across the man's face. I don't recommend you speak that way to me, friend. I've just asked a question, and I'm expecting an answer. He looks at you, then back to Virgil. We can make this simple or more difficult. Oh, I think difficult is the best way, sir. I find that there's fewer questions afterwards. I'm ready to begin this discussion whenever you are. Okay. Um. The man seems unsure of what to do. You see fear in his eyes. Perhaps this is a discussion we'll have later, friend. I'm sure that this issue will be resolved in time. He looks at you, nodding, in his eyes a burning hatred. Good day to you, sir. Uh, good day to you, then. <laughs> that, that was close. Virgil is visibly shaken. What do you mean, Virgil? He obviously was scared of you. That man very well could have killed us both. Believe me, I've seen his kind before. So why did you provoke him? <laughs> it was all bluster. I'm no bloody warrior. But sometimes you have to be able to act the part. You learn such things on, on, well, um, it's just something I've learned. Fear is a powerful weapon. Something is very wrong here. I think we'd best get out of here as soon as possible. Let's go then. Sir, you might wish to consult your map. I believe there might be a quicker way to Shrouded Hills. Oh, and this is the travel map. Okay. So very similar to Fallout 1 and 2, you click on locations and then you begin your journey and things can happen between where you are and where you go. You can also go to Arbola's house though. Maybe we should check that out first. But before we do anything, let's go down here and kill these wolves. Oh God, that's a lot of wolves, let's save it. Boop. 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 Get him. Jeez, man. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Almost died on tutorial map. 
Good job, Ko. Uh, okay. We have another point. Um... What do I want? Does this add to Dex? Yeah. Maybe more, maybe more willpower? Um... Hmm. Give me more persuasion. Let me use that though. He also needs more strength. I there's so many things I want to put up right now. <laughs> I could also get minor healing. Healing's always good. Let's get more willpower for now. Yeah, let's get more willpower for now. We're gonna need it. What's this? Scheme? Are these like built-in builds? Whoa. The hell? Interesting. Huh. I'm not gonna use them. Yeah, no. All right, let's go here and then we're gonna go to Arbalus house. Oh, wait. How do, I, how do I reset? There we go. Boop. Boop. Nice. Oh, it is late. This hearthstone headstone is exquisitely carved with the message, Jamala, beloved wife and mother. This headstone is exquisitely carved with this message, Saif, beloved son. Oh. Well, that, that's unfortunate. Uh, let's wait until morning. There we go. Is there anything else here? No. Okay. Oh, there's blood on the floor. That's good. Um, let's save it before we do this. Hmm. Big Mag! Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. You, you you always got some shelter here, my friend. Don't you ever worry about it. Merry Met, brother! I don't believe I've had the pleasure. Who are you? The wizened old priest seems to be in some pain. I am Arbala, he winces. And you are? Oh. Oh, my. I am Ko. Well, Ko, what brings you to my humble farm? I'm simply traveling about. What happened to you? My family was brutally slaughtered by two madmen, Brego and Farkas. I believe their names were. I was left for dead. I welcomed them into my house, offered them sustenance, and they repaid me by killing my wife and children and stealing the only thing I had of any value, a sacred religious artifact. Oh, damn. I met the spirit of one of those killers. One of them is dead already? I shouldn't be surprised. Probably killed by the other, I would assume. Dreadfully evil people they were. Brego told me your curse made his friend turn on him. Uh-oh. Um. What is it that you want of me? That's weird. It, it like, double-clicked. Alright. Who might you be? I am Ko. Simply traveling about. I'm at the spirit. No, I believe that was the curse of greed. Their souls will never leave this plane of existence, but that was the only curse I put on them. If I had to guess, Farkas decided he didn't want to share the ill-gotten gains with anyone. As I said, they were truly evil individuals. I'm sorry for your loss. Thank you for your kind words, but there's something else. I need to recover the sacred artifact they stole. It's very important to me. I needed to pray to my gods effectively. Did Brego say anything? Give any clue to where it might be? No, he did not. He hobbles a bit closer to you. I know it's none of your affair, but could you assist me in trying to locate what is rightfully mine? It's the least I can do. Any ideas where I should start? Excellent. Perhaps our friend, the late Mr. Brego, would have had some information he could impart to you regarding location of my sacred possession. I appreciate your kindness, though I regret I have nothing to give you for your help. I will return when I have retrieved your property. Interesting. Is there anything else here? I don't think so. OK. 
Okay. Let's uh, go back and talk to this guy. Hmm. You got some splaining to do, fella. Hey, zombie sorry, dude. It's our pleasure. Thank you for hanging out, man. You have no, dude. We have over 10,000 people watching Arcanum. Thank you. <laughs> Just thank you for being here. <laughs> it's so cool. Uh, I need to talk to the friend that killed you. The pain. So you spoke with Arbla instead of killing him. Bravo, my friend. I applaud you. Tell me where Farkas is. Why should I tell you that? I will still be here for eternity. I convinced Arbola to release you if you help me. Lie. Damn it, it did it again. What what is I'm I'm not double clicking. Can I can I is there like a a, a log? Arr! Okay. So we're gonna have to quick save before we talk to anyone. Do a hard save. I've been that for a while. Did I already talk to this guy? I'm assuming I did, right? Um. Okay, so here. Yeah, dude, it's totally clicking like multiple times. Okay. Uh, I lost. I not. Start. Which one have your property? Okay. Try arrow keys and enter for dialogue. I will try that. Thank you. I will also try... Uh, uh, somebody else said I could try the number keys. I will try both those things. Thank you. Thank you. Check my double click speed for this in, in the mouse software. I will. Um, I will look at that in a bit. Thank you. How old is my mouse? Oh, it's a brand new mouse. It's, it's a Corsair mouse that I've been trying out the last couple months. It works, I, for some reason it only seems to do it in this. Like it, it doesn't do it in other things. So I, maybe it has something to do with the, the, the DX file I installed or something, I'm not sure. Anyway, save. Okay. Okay, arrow keys don't do anything and number keys don't do anything either. Oh, good. Uh, I had a conversation with Avila. Oh, I need to talk to the friend that killed you. Where is he? There we go. You would, wouldn't you? If there is one thing about you noble types is that you'll do the right thing, even if it kills you. Very well, anything to be released from this pain. He points to a location on your map. Farkas is here. Thank you for the information. Please hurry and release me from this pain. <laughs> yeah, okay. Does loot in containers respawn? No. No, it doesn't. Mm -mm 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 Uh. Okay. So let's go back and see if we can. Oh, we gotta go down to here, I guess, to fast travel. Yeah. Did I talk with the dwarf on the crash site? I don't see a dwarf. Oh, oh, you mean the one that died? No, no, I think he's dead. He's like in there somewhere. Yeah, I, I think that boy dead. I don't think he made it. We checked for a pulse and everything. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He did. I see you, he did. Oh, he, re oh, he real dead. By the way, some people have been asking what we're playing tomorrow morning. I think I may start a new RimWorld run tomorrow morning. Yeah. I think you might play some RimWorld tomorrow morning. Simon Farkas's shack. Oh, there, double clicked again. Save. Anything around here? The path? No, it's not. New update or something? No, I, I just, I haven't played RimWorld in a long time. We, we got some time to kill before Death Stranding, and I don't want to start, like, a, a big run. We may play some RimWorld, probably play more Arcanum, maybe some Outer World. Uh, we got a VR thing. I'm going to be playing some, um, some Asgard's Wrath. 
uh, Tuesday. I'm taking Tuesday morning off, by the way. And then um, and drop frames on Wednesday. We'll have, we'll have a lot to do this week. A lot of different things. Okay, here we go. Save it. 